Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and very good morning. Okay, um, this I will uh, this video I will show you how to calculate a total chargeable income. All right. So uh, as you know that after we get aggregate income. Alright, and then you minus total relief, so you will get 64,200. Okay, 64,200 in a tax marginal table, so you be arranged around uh, category E, that is 15,000 to 70,000, alright? For the first tax on the first, right tax on the first for Fidaus is uh, a for Zakaria is a is a one thousand eight hundred is according to the table. Okay, right this one is already uh, provided in the table. Right, the tax on the tax balance. Right. So this one, uh, okay. Right, this one, okay. This one will be, uh, for the first fifty thousand, right? So sixty-four thousand, uh, two hundred, okay, minus fifty thousand. So you will be equal to equal to sixty four sixty four thousand two hundred minus fifty thousand. So you will get fourteen thousand two hundred. Alright. So the fifth fourteen thousand two hundred multiplied by zero point one four is the rate so will be equal to okay so you will get 1988 okay okay so the six first 64,000 is category E I repeat back so minus the first for 50,000 so it already include in the table so it's 1,800 and then um, the balance is 14,200 is multiplied by marginal rate is a 14% so it's is shows in the table so you multiply by that and you will get 1988 all right so you total up 1000 okay 1000 1800 plus 1988 so you will get 3788 all right so we have rebates here okay you will minus a rebate for this uh zakaria so he he chargeable income is more than thirty five thousand. so he's not entitled any self rebate that is a 400 ringgit right so but he paid zakat okay he paid zakat so the total is 2200 right so three thousand eight three thousand seven hundred eighty eight minus two hundred two thousand two hundred so you will get the balance that table so this is supposed to paid by uh, tax payable meaning that you owe to LHDN right so this one you owe to LHDN but however this one monthly tax deduction you already uh, you already paid monthly to the LHDN, alright, 4,800. So the yearly is 4,800. Okay, but your tax is actually you need to pay 1,588. So that's why 3,212 is a excess. So this excess, it should be the 3,212 is refund by LHDN. Okay, because your tax is actually one thousand 
588 okay so however but you already pay more than that so LHDL should refund this 3212 okay okay now we go for um, uh, Nadira okay Nadira so you will get a total chargeable income okay so to 24,000 to 800 okay 24,800 okay so this one is under category C okay under category C so for the first 20,000 it will charge you 150 ringgit so this one already displayed in the table okay so another remaining okay another remaining how that we get this one okay the, the other remaining is example like 24800 minus okay 24800 the first 20000 okay the first 20000 okay for the first 20000 so you will get balance okay 4800 so the remaining 4800 multiplied by 3% 0.03 okay 0.03 so you will get okay so you will get 0.03 so you so you will get okay by 0.03 so you will get 1 Four, four. Okay. Okay. So, how did I get one four four? Is based on this one. Okay. And then you will total up, so you will get two hundred and ninety four. So this is your tax label. Okay. But however, uh, under rebate, if the income under thirty five thousand, right? If income under thirty five thousand, so you entitled for. 400 ringgit okay so automatically if you are your income is under 35,000 so automatically you are entitled for 400 ringgit all right and then zakat paid is 500 ringgit all right okay all right so um is is already more than uh, because this one is already more than rebate so 294 so it's equal to zero so however in monthly deduction she paid for one two six zero okay so actually when you get zero meaning that you are not not no need to pay the tax to LHDN but so in this case LHDN should be refunded 2160 to Nadira, right? So it should be refined to Nadira, okay? So it should be refined to Nadira. That's why take pay in excess, it should be refined to the tax payer. I hope that you will understand uh, when you get more rebates and also when you pay the actual amount and the LHDM will the refund the actual amount. Okay, because zakat is you already paid to the institution uh, institution so 400 is just like a value but actually the actual amount that you are paying to uh, to LHDN is 1,160 uh, that's why the take pay access is 2160 not this one okay this one is not uh, you cannot plus the zakat okay so just state whatever that you have been deducted monthly and then that is also refined by the LHDN. I think that's all for this part. I hope that you can understand uh, and you will re 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 do the revision on this uh, chapter uh, on this uh, question again because it will help you to understand this part. Alright, so the lower the lower uh, part of tax uh, planning uh, answer, right? I think that's all. Thank you so much.